Hi, I'm V from Packer Micro, and today we're introducing Packer Micro's Easy Positioner. TB60 is designed specifically to work with Packer Micro's R Probe on a PCB in horizontal orientation. Out of the box, you'll have a steel base as lifted to your right, a probe arm with XYZ stage, and hex key with screws. Now, let's assemble them together, making sure the probe arm is securely tightened onto the steel base using the four screws and hex key provided. Now that the TP60 Easy Position is assembled, let's check out the functions. Under the steel base is anti-static rubber to work on regular surfaces and magnets inside the base. To show you how strong the magnetic force is, let's use this 10 pound steel block. We'll lift it to see how secure the easy positioner stays on. XYZ stage of the probe arm. X controls the front and backward movement, Y controls the left and right directions, and the Z screw allows up and down movement. Each stage can be moved 500 microns per turn. There's also a theta control on the side that maneuvers the lateral position of the probe tips. Next, I'm going to show the broad range that the TP60 can cover in terms of height. First, loosen this coarse height adjustment screw in order to easily move the probe arm up and down in any position you'd like. If you want to move the probe arm even higher, loosen the screw even more, rotate the probe arm upwards, and tie in the screw to lock in place. As you see, you'll have to flip over the probe adapter for proper orientation. Here in this photo, you'll see the probe adapter is in the right position and the probe arm reconfigured to reach the high position. The second photo demonstrates the probe arm reconfigured to reach a low position upon rotating the probe arm back down. Now that you have an idea of the features of the TP60, let's start probing. We'll be using a small PCB board for today's example. However, any size board can be used. Let's take the R probe out of the box and put the provided two screws into the R probe while using the 2mm hex key to secure it onto the probe adapter. Now we'll begin to move our positioner closer to the points we want to test, using the XYZ stage to maneuver the tip. For instance, we can use the Y knob to move the probe tip right and left to contact different pins. So this is how the TB60 is used as a recommendation for engineers and customers to probe their high-speed circuit boards. Also, here in our setup, we seriously want you to consider using a digital microscope for your high-speed probing needs. As seen in the previous example, thank you for watching. Check us out at PackerMicro.com and subscribe by clicking the button below.